Hello everyone, my name is Max as Wildborn and welcome to Haunted Towers, where our main focus is to be wary of these knights. Those knights are invulnerable until you go talk to this fairy after you do something about this Nork Commando. Gems. Smack this guy. Open that. Flame this guy and flame this guy. You have to flame everyone because uh, they do drop the gems, and if you want to beat the level, then, or beat the level 100% rather, then you will have to uh, enchant bomb everybody. But there is a fairy in this level that gives you infinite uh, enchanting, enchanted flame. That guy is gonna block you. You'll have to talk to this fairy. Get the kiss and flame that guy, or else you won't pass. You run that path! He Gandalfs you. I kinda wanna refresh my uh, kiss. Kissy, kissy. Oh, I gotta let it wear off first. Kissy, kissy. Won't you just follow me around and just like. Constantly playing a kiss on my cheek. That would help me a whole lot. I mean, I'm saving the world, am I not? Okay. So that was good work on my part. I mean, you didn't have to go back and get a kiss. I mean, you can just wait until you get, um, the kid. Okay, Ko Kosoko? Hey, Spyro. All dragons know there's magic in a fairy's kiss. See what it can do to your power of flame. What this guy don't know is that we were actually forced to figure out what it does to our flame because we could not pass over there until we went through a guy that that uh, was invulnerable and could only be affected by the enchant. So, yeah. That uh, hint was kind of moot. Because by the time... We rescued him, we figured out what was going on anyway. I was saying something. Oh yeah, the fairy that gives you infinite power. You can just wait and go back, but it's okay. Also, need that. Uh, there's a fairy there. I can go back for the gems later, but right now it's more important that I... Aw. <laughs> I wanted to flame the door, but I had to get rid of that one guy. But it's okay, I suppose. I can always just go back. It's not like... It's not like I'm losing anything, so... The time. Kiss me, kiss me! I'm not... <laughs> That's a little silly. So yeah, those little wizard things are what is bringing the uh, the giant or the the uh, knights back to life. So supercharger also take care of these doors. You want to be rather careful. With... Oh, Lutalo. Hold your horns. Here comes Spyro. Patience, little one. You oh shit! Opportunity to battle the one who matters most, nasty Nord. I just, hold on a second, I just broke the rail on my key, okay, no it didn't, never mind, I fixed it. <laughs> right, it's very here. I was gonna make a comment on, uh, Spyro's little, hold your horns, here comes Spyro, what if he, like, <laughs> Spyro ever got a girlfriend? And he found himself in a situation where uh, he was in the bed with another with another dragon. Hold your horns, here comes Spyro! <laughs> oh lordy lord. Damn. Anyway. Oh, I was gonna say something else, but then the thought fucking left me. 
Ugh. I hate that. Anyway, we're about to go to the secret-ish area. Provided that I don't fail this. So let's go down here. I'm gonna go to the last door on the right. You want to jump over here. And then at the very top of that ramp, you want to leap and fly over here. There's also a dragon over here whose name is Capano. You've become a master of the supercharge. Great work. Uh, there's trackos outside. Oh, uh, you're gonna hear them doing the beep beep. Oh, once you arrive into this room, be a quick. Be a quickie. Uh, oh, damn it. I'm not gonna be quick this time around. Damn it. Because I got fucking cock blocked by one of those damn bastards. But, um, if you're quick enough, you can actually make it all the way up there without having to mess with the knights. So uh, we'll just step out here. Hopefully that resets them. And now, yep, it resets. Let's try to be quick. Oh, that was a close one there. Damn it! Smack this guy. And now, this is the infinite fairy. Her kiss will last for the remainder of this level. The enchant will not follow you into the home world, so don't think you have, like, infinite awesome power of awesomeness. Okay. So you can basically go around the entire level and kill all the knights that you've missed so far. That hurt, by the way. And also, before I leave, there is one box out here that can use your attention. It had an awful lot of gems in it. So, we can fall down here, and we're now over in this direction. Uh, you could use Supercharge to get this, uh, this chest over here, but, you know, you can always come back, save a bit of time, just come back when you have the infinite chant. And the last place to visit is over here. You're gonna get super fired. Look like how they throw a grenade. Like when they die, they, they, the grenade just falls backwards. And it, it does blow up, which is funny. I don't think it like hurts you when it does. Also, you don't need the infinite chant to go through here because there is a fairy in the corner. But uh, yeah, the fairies are moot once you get the infinite chant, so. Just stare at their breasts if that's something you feel like wasting your time on. Does that complete the level? It does. So, so I'm scratching my nose there. Oh, you see the little idle animation he did there. Anyway, I'll see you in the ball stage.